Hello again, friends. If you're returning, welcome back. If you're new, welcome. My name is Rachel. I'm a part-time reseller on sites like eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari, and lately on Whatnot. And today I have an unboxing from a brand new box that I've just recently saw on ThreadUp for the first time. It is the J. Crew and More 15 Pieces Mystery Box. So if you want to check out what came inside, stick around. So I've never seen this box before and it just happened to pop up and it was by size. So I actually snagged one that is supposedly all large and extra large and it's supposed to be J. Crew, Banana Republic and more. So like and similar brands. Um, I ordered a similar box like this from Cozy Threads, which apparently has since changed their name. It's a little soon in the game for them to be already changing their name if you ask me, but that's neither here nor there. I can post that video up here if you want to see it. It was long story short, it was all Banana Republic and a lot of it had stains or flaws that I just couldn't sell a lot of it. So anyway, drop me a like if you find this helpful. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel. I do post reseller content two to three times a week. I do unboxing videos so you guys can see what comes in these mystery boxes and make decisions for your own reseller business. Uh, I also do 90 day updates on all my mystery boxes to show you guys what sold and how much money I made. And I will also do that for this one. In the meantime, I'm opening this for the first time. Uh, it is sealed. And this one came from Suwanee, Georgia, in case you guys are wondering. So let's open it up. I will either list it or I will sell it on whatnot. And I'll come back in 90 days and let you guys know how it's sold. So let's see what this guy says. Uh, same thing. J. Crew, Banana Republic, and more. Rescue box. Size large, extra large, 14, 16. So... Maybe worst case scenario, I'll get some stuff for myself. That is technically my size, my tissue paper. And uh, here's what it looks like on top. So, oh, I paid for this. I'm sure you guys wanna know that. I paid for this box $52.99, $52 including tax and shipping. So if there are 15 items in here, that's $3.53 per item. I didn't think that was too bad if I have a bunch of G. Crew and Ban Banana Republic. So let's dive on in. All right. First up, <laughs> this is Old Navy. This is not J. Crew Banana Republic. So, okay, thanks, guys. Um, but it is an Old Navy dress. Cami dress. Cami dress, size extra large. Boy, I hope there's more than Old Navy in here, guys. Let's be honest. Yikes, thread up. It does say it'll include similar brands. I don't think that Old Navy is similar to J. Crew and Banana Republic personally, but this one's J. Crew Factory. It's another dress. This is a lot more fall like. Very preppy. It's the plaid, it's got pockets. Um, it is a little bit older tag. Let me see if I can find a uh date code on here fall 2017 okay so like not terribly old so okay these are some talbot's pants okay so talbot's pants size 14 they are new with tag uh, or actually this is a skirt brand new with skirt brand new with tags maxi skirt this is a maxi so it's sort of like business casual meets like loungewear because it's got like a drawstring. It does go all the way to the floor. Interesting. Definitely an older style, but brand new with tags. So, okay. I'm good with that, I guess. I don't love photographing black, but it is what it is. New York and Company. This is another cami shirt. That's cute, I guess. All right, I don't hate it. I don't love it. New York and Company doesn't sell real well, resell wise. This is a big, big ribbed sweatshirt thingy with no brand. Seriously, this has no brand? This is like a sweater dress. Hold on, what is it? It's from Target. Oh, there it is, a new day.
Um, yeah. Do it that what what you will. Universal thread, more Target brand. This is like a like a, a shawl, like a, a layering piece. Yikes. This is Ann Taylor. So this is a navy blue kind of career blouse. It's got little feathers on it. Shorts, little shorts, old navy active, size extra large. Oh boy. Universal thread, t-shirt, seriously? Oh my gosh. Gap, nope, Old Navy. Old Navy, um, are these linen? Are they linen wannabe? Linen blend. Last piece, last couple pieces. Oh my gosh. All right, J. Crew new tags. I'm cool with that. This is a nice cardigan, I guess. Yeah, this is like a open front cardigan. It's got some pockets. Navy blue, nice layering piece. Okay, okay. Thankfully, I should be able to make my money back on this box with just that one piece. White House Black Market. This is a fun dress, actually. Um, this leopard print with the color blocking. Okay. T-shirt. Universal thread again. J. Crew number two pencil skirt, size 10, which uh, the description does say there might be some sizes outside of the described. Size 10, okay, fine. Uh, at least it's not like an extra small because I ordered a box of large and extra large. Um, I don't love selling pencil skirts or anything solid black, so it is what it is though. This is the last piece. This is Gap, and this is like a chambray open back top. The MSRP is $49.95. It is brand new with tags. Okay, um, let me count, make sure there's 15 pieces, and I'll give you my opinion on this box, although you could probably guess what I'm already going to say. Okay, so it is exactly 15 pieces. That is as described. Um, I definitely am on the fence about how I feel about this box. Uh, and I want to know, I want to open the floor up to you guys. Let me know what you guys think. So it said J. Crew, Banana Republic, and more. It did say that there would be some sizes outside of the large, extra large range. It did say that it could contain other brands. Um, to me, Target brands do not compare to J. Crew and Banana Republic. It's not, you got a big box store and a mall brand, right? And actually a, a higher end mall brand. Those two don't compare. Um, so the fact, like the White House Black Market, the Ann Taylor, I'm good with those. Like I get it, those are similar brands, not necessarily what the title of the box is, but the Old Navy and the Target, not cool. Now the, the thing is though, like the stuff that is as described is really good, like that, that um, J. Crew Cardigan will, in all honesty, probably pay for the box. L let's be honest. But, you know, with, with mystery boxes, it's, you take the good with the bad and you're not always able to sell all of it. Um, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I've never complained a thread up ever. 
I almost feel like I need to say something about this though. Like, let me know what you guys think in the comments. With a secondhand or like a rescue box of secondhand clothing, my goal is always to triple my money. So if I can make 150 on this box, I'll say it's a good box. I don't know if I'm going to make quite that much because there's so many pieces I probably won't even list being Target and Old Navy, but I'll let you guys know either way. So stay tuned for the 90 day update. Make sure you're subscribed. Hit the notification bell if you want to see additional videos from me and know when they're posted. Drop me a like on the way out. If you're still here, you might as well because you made it this far. But that's it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will catch you in the next one.